today we're going to be talking about snack containers and the plethora of options you have so you can have in um, different needs and different options for different birth groups. So our first look is going to be on snack containers and we can kind of use for formula if you're still formula feeding um, and that way it can transition into a toddler snack container. So the first thing I'll look at is this kind. I know that it's missing the uh, the little container that goes in between the dividers, but I just couldn't find it. So just to give you an idea, basically this is the, the ones that you unscrew the top and you can pour it out into the uh, milk, into the water and shake it up and you're ready to go. This is nice uh, because it's compact. I mean, you can essentially, it's a cylinder, you put it into your diaper bag, you're ready to go. The only issue I have with this is just that, like, it's, it was a little bit cumbersome when we were using it for formula, because it was like, it would take forever to screw it on, do this, I just, it didn't work for us, but it doesn't mean it's not a good product, it's just, it didn't work for us. So, that's this kind of container. You can put Cheerios, whatever, anything you or child wants to eat, dry snacks, all that fun stuff. So you can put that in there. Then the other one is this style. You know, the ones you can find at Target, all that stuff. Uh, very easy to find. You just put, it has um, three dividers and then you essentially just open it up, pour it in, and you're ready to go. This is for formula and can work nicely for... Um, snacks as well then you have something like the inno baby this one works well and the thing that i like the most about it is that you can actually see what's inside um i i like for some reason i just like it when i can see how much is left because it lets you know what you need to repack it's just easier for you if you know what you need to replenish at a in a second you know especially if you're going to run out the door real fast Another one you can use, now we're going to go into actual dry snacks, um, not so much the formula ones. These are really inexpensive um, options. This one I actually received uh, from my sister, picked this up for my son at the grocery store. And it's just, it has like fishes in it. And it's really easy to clean and it's rather flat. So it's easy to put into the diaper bag. Um, it comes right off. It's easy to clean. And this is the part that you would raise up. This is probably like $2.99 at the grocery store. Um, and you know, these are the same ones, the same style. I think that they have for like the goldfishes. So you can use that. Um, it's, it's like different animals, I guess you can call it. So that's that one. This is a very inexpensive option. Another one is, I actually found these at, a, my son loves Sesame Street, and I found these in the dollar spot at Target, and I, I want to say it was like a dollar fifty or maybe not more than two dollars or something, and all you do is just move the eyes back, and there is your snacks. This is nice, the only thing that I have to say about this is that the crumbs, kind of like from puffs and the crackers and fishes and stuff, is that the, the crumbs come out, so... It's cute and it's fun for the kids, but I just, I hate the crumbs falling out. So you can tell it kind of looks sealed, but somehow those little crumbs make their way out. So this is another inexpensive option. And then some, I'm just, this is not like a name brand or anything, but I found this in, um, it's like a just random thing store, I guess. And it has the four little locks and you'd open it up and there you go so that's cute especially like if you want to take baby food or something this is a good option another option is um, this actually I saw at Walmart and for a minute I thought it was the boon you know the boon snack container but it isn't it's actually uh first years I don't know if you can read the logo there it's first year and it's like a boon copycat i guess and this just it's really cool looking 
and you just um, slide this over. It kind of locks into these little on notches there. And then you just um, move it over and it locks. This, this part comes off so you can remove it. So it's easy. And then this part unscrews also. I just can't do it one handed. But it unscrews and washes really easily. That's cute too. It's, um, the, it's better. These is, um, this type is good with the crumbs. But it was super cheap. It was maybe like $5. I don't know. Maybe less. Um, another inexpensive option is um, these take and toss containers. Because uh, they're you can fit a lot in here. And it could be like, you know, uh, crackers and all that. The bigger um, snacks and these come in packs of four or three or something like that but it's it's I'm sure it's less than like five dollars so that's another option now moving into a little bit more um, an expensive not expensive um just a different price point this is the skip hop zoo snack a set it actually comes with both so when you buy this, you would get this one that's kind of like a sandwich size. And then this one that's, um, you can put dry snacks in it. So let me just show you. It's got a ton of room inside. So you can really take a lot of snacks with you. So this right now is filled with fishes, the gold fishes. And it has a little handle on the back. So it's really cute um, to just hang off of your shoulder. If you have like little shoulder hooks and then... You, you, all you have to do is just open it up and feed your child. Like if you're walking around, you don't want to really stop. So that's easy. And then to clean it, all you have to do is just pull it inside out. The bottom, let me just close it up because I don't want it to spill. Um, the bottom is flat. So when we go out and we put it on a table, it um, sits nice and you don't have to worry about it falling over. So that's really nice. I like that. Uh, feature about it um this matches the different zoo packs right now they don't have all of the animals from their the skip hop zoo packs but i'm hoping eventually they will the first release was like a monkey the blue owl and i want to say the bee but i'm not 100 no the blue dog um the blue dog the monkey and the what did i just say <laughs> the blue dog the monkey and yeah so anyway they have this we have the monkey backpack so it was cute to have it match and then the last option is uh itsy ritzy snack bags this is the mini it comes in a pack of two and this is a one pack and it's retails for about 9.99 this one you could probably find it for less and this one is a two pack and I want to say I got it for like $12.99 or something like that on Amazon. It was a little bit pricier than actually just picking it up at the store. But where I live, we can't get it. So I had to order it. So um, this was a, it's a nice option. And the, the outside is completely cotton. I'm not actually using it for snacks right now. Um, this one I think is like first aid stuff. And then this is like our um, restaurant supplies. Like if we go to a restaurant all the stuff for the restaurant so you don't have to use it for snack bags that's what i like and essentially if we we travel a lot so if we travel i can organize his things inside bags as opposed to like just throwing everything in there so these are different options for snack containers uh all of these are literally under like five dollars one two three four five I'm not sure how much this retails for because someone gave it to me, but I'm sure it's not that expensive. And this for sure is not more than $6, if that. Um, and then this one is a little bit pricier. It's probably like almost $9, $10. But really, you're getting like three containers. So it's kind of worth it. Thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe and let me know if there's anything that any ideas that you have that are not shown here because I love to learn about new snack containers, obviously. And uh, thanks for watching.